In the last video, I told you people that I would come up with a video showing how two atoms of different elements combine to form molecules. And in this video, I'm going to tell you how. So let's try to make the atom of water. Now, we all know that water is... Water contains hydrogen and oxygen. Okay? So let's make the atom of hydrogen first protons are, are proton is one neutron is one the nucleus the first shell if you would remember from my last video the first shell contains two electrons can contain up to two electrons so i think i messed up with the color the first shell can contain up to two electrons but hydrogen in case of hydrogen it contains only one electron and now let's make uh, the atom of oxygen so protons are eight neutrons are eight again the nucleus and i told you the first shell contains two electrons and the second shell can, can, can contain up to eight electrons but in oxygen it contains only six electrons mm. two three four five six now to combine atoms either accept or donate electrons in their outermost shells and these outermost shells are called valence shells the atoms that accept electrons, in this case oxygen, have a negative valency. They have a negative valency. And the ones that donate, in this case hydrogen, have a positive valency. And just for information, valency is the number of electrons accepted or donated by the outermost shell of an atom so let's donate this electron comes here so now hydrogen the electron requirement for hydrogen is complete it has donated it it's one and only electron but what about oxygen it still needs one more electron to complete the eight electrons in its outer shell so for that let's take one more atom of hydrogen proton is one neutron is one and electron is one so now this electron comes here so now hydrogen this atom of hydrogen has donated all its electrons in its valence shell or has completed its valence shell this atom of hydrogen has also completed its valence shell and so has this atom of oxygen. Now, when all is complete, two atoms of hydrogen and one atom of oxygen make water. 